how to get 360 ways and I'm your boy blue ways so this is my second video and uh, on my first video I kind of went through the motions about what you need to get started to get 360 ways um I am currently in my fifth week of, of what's called woofing and that's what this 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 uh, video is about today is about woofing woofing is kind of like spring training for uh, for, for uh, uh, athletes, it's, it's it's when you train your waves. When you first start to get 360 waves, you gotta you gotta get your hair used to laying down, and the best way to do that is to to woof. Um, wow, it got real dark real quick. Um, I, I'm using natural light. I'm a photographer, so I'm using natural light to do this video, and um, I think a cloud or something just blocked the sun, so it got real dark. Yeah, excuse me for that. But anyway, um. Whooping. That's when you let your hair grow out and you just brush, 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 brush. As you can tell now, my hair looks kind of puffy. Um, like I said, and I'm into uh, going into uh, my second week, my, excuse me, my second month of woofing. Uh, you have to get you a, a real hard brush when you woof. This is the Diane 8159. I don't know if you can see that. Um, it's a hard brush. Now, if your hair is low, you can't even use a hard brush because it'll, it'll hurt your scalp. But when, when you start whooping and your hair gets real thick, you, you won't even feel it. In fact, my hair is so thick that I could barely feel the these bristles getting to my, my scalp. So, and I've been having waves on and off all my life, uh, my adult life. So, I've, I've had them before, got a fro, got dreads, and I'm back on, 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 the, on the waves now. But uh, whooping is a very important part of, of, of you training your hair to lay down. And as you, as you can tell, I'm not quite all the way there yet because when your hair is laying down, it doesn't puff out. Because basically what waves are, waves are like curls. Curls. So you want the curl to lay out flat against your hair. You don't want to curl up and go up. You want to lay flat against your hair. So when you're uh, when you're your hair is trained. The the, the waves, the 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 curls, waves, whatever. They'll lay flat. When they puff up, your hair not trained yet. So, bring in woofing. Woofing trains the hair. So, you want to at least probably run you about three woofing sessions a year. Uh, this is the beginning of the year, so I'm gonna run one in the beginning of the year. I'm gonna get uh, uh, scheduled cuts for about three or four months. I'm gonna woof again, and at the end of the year, I'm gonna woof again. So, woofing helps pattern your hair. Whooping is a very part of 360 waves. Get you a hard brush when your hair starts to grow so you can still hit the scalp and help train the hair. This is your boy Blue Waves. How to get 360 waves. I'm out.